Hi, you guys. So I'm going to get right into it. June empties. June empties and all the goodness that comes with the June empties. Let me just dump all this stuff. I had a lot. And uh, some garbage in here. So we're going to put it in this container and uh, move on. So, um, always radiant. This is a monthly repurchase. You guys have seen it in my empties before. Women who have periods, you guys know the deal there. Um, how did I get freaking a napkin in here? I have no idea. Um, <clears throat> so I want to talk supplements quick. This is my spirulina. I usually, um, I usually take two of these a day. They do help in repairing tissue and cells in your body. Do your research. It is a fantastic supplement <clears throat> for well well-being and wellness and health um right now i'm using the capsule version i think i like the capsule version better um but they are from the same brand so it's the same thing just different um different carrier in the sense that this is more of a jam-packed little tablet and the capsule i prefer the capsule when it comes to swallowing so um I also have Genuine Health Probiotic in the Cranberry, um, and I also have the Probiotic 50 Billion in Extra Strength. I honestly don't know how I finished two in a month. I feel like I was just, like, finishing this off at the beginning of the month, and then um, I had, like, 29 of these um, that I was able to finish <clears throat> for the month of June. So... Um, typically you're supposed to like, re like, uh, what's the word? Rotate out your probiotics, like use a different brand every few times, just so that your body doesn't get used to the same strands all the time. So I'm just going through my stock with these ones. And then once I run through these ones, I'm going to, I'm going to try my, um, uh, another brand that I typically use when I rotate out. <clears throat> then I have the Camprev Women's Multi. I use this religiously. Um, I um, Right now I'm using the Camprev Prenatal because they have the exact same ingredients in the exact same doses. The only difference is that Prenatal comes with 120 capsules opposed to the 90. So I got to make my money, you know, work where I can. <clears throat> so I got the Prenatals instead. Um, I also have vitamin E, uh, capsules from New Roots. I have repurchased. Um, I basically healed myself when I went through a very, very, very ugly time with my health in January. Um, and I had to wait six months to see a specialist. By the time I saw the specialist in June, I had healed myself with all of my supplements. So do your research. You can fix yourself with with sup with natural herbal supplements as long as you are consistent and you are very consistent with them you will be able to heal yourself um i'm thinking of doing a video on that so uh comment down below if you're interested to hear that experience because um it did take me about four or five months but i did i was able to heal myself and i you know, by the time I, I got to the specialist and I told her what had happened, she's like, I can't really do anything more for you because you've already done it. So, um, California Gold Nutrition Silimarian Complex, which is a support for liver health. Um, it's got milk thistle, dandelion, artichoke, curcumin, which it's a very small, um, turmeric is like 25 milligrams. I take more than, than that, like throughout the day um but this is a great uh liver support because your liver does quite a lot in your body and not many people know how important your liver is uh sea berry therapy omega-7 sea buckthorn oil this is a wonderful omega omega family supplement 
It has helped me in my uterine health in so many different ways. And I continue to take it. It is quite expensive. Like, um, a 30 doll, a 30 tablet or sorry, 30 capsule, 60 soft gels is 30 days. And it's about roughly 27 to $30 a bottle. So if you get four months worth, it's about 70 bucks a bottle when you include taxes. It's very expensive. However, I feel like I can't put a price on my health because this also saved my uterine health when I was going through a lot. So, you know, I, uh, I was able to heal myself and that's just the, that's just the gist of it. Right. Um, I also finished the Purica Lysine, L-Lysine Re Regenerative Re Re Support. I don't typically use these on a regular basis, but if I feel like my immune system is a little bit like low, I will start this and, and do a round of it. So there was 180 capsules in here. This, I started this probably in like March, April timeframe and it lasted me till July. So, um, <clears throat> like early July, cause I finished it like just at the last week of June, which was like perfect timing. It was like end of June, beginning of July. So, um, this is, is great to uh, supplement into your diet when you are, your immune system is low. If you suffer a lot from cold sores, that also helps. Um, but I do find that even if you have skin disorders like eczema or lichen planus, um, like I did, I had lichen planus, this does help with your immune because it's, the skin disorders are an autoimmune thing. So, um, the L-lysine is definitely a great support for your immune system. Again, do your research, folks. I did tons of research on the supplements that I took, um, and my specialist has cleared me in the sense that I'm doing everything right. So typically a lot of doctors also push drugs, but I'm really, I'm really impressed that this specialist, um, when I was honest with her about the supplements that I was taking in order for myself to heal, she was like, I, there's nothing for me to do. You did it all yourself. So you're good to go. So, I mean, there are some good doctors out there. You just got to find them. Um, I finished a coconut sandalwood white barn gentle foaming hand soap bath and body works love their soaps continue to rebuy I have a back stock because I can't live without them I have a um, L'Oreal in uh, flash cat eye eyeliner I ruined the tip I don't know if you guys can see that like I tried to cut the tip off because it was like frayed and it didn't work out. So I had to let this go. Um, I basically got like maybe a month of use out of this. And because of the, because the tip was frayed, I don't know what is up with the cap. I think the cap is what causes it. Um, I didn't repurchase this. I just figured it's better that I don't. And I bought something else instead to replace it. Um, I only did one facial mask this month, you guys. I don't know why. I feel like, I, I don't, I don't, honestly, I don't know why. I did the Dr. Jart Hydra uh, Solution Single Mask. This one was good. Liked it. I love the Dr. Jart stuff. I've never had an issue with it. Um, Guru Nanda Pulling Oil Coconut and Mint for your teeth. I have to start doing it again. The last, like, five days I've been away, so I haven't really been like doing pulling oil in my teeth I need to start doing that but I do like it I just find that coconut oil regular does the same actually does better job than this so like it's cheaper as well so I mean I have I have some I think I had one more of these so I'm going to use it up and then I'm just going to use coconut oil I have like a tub of coconut oil sitting the bottom of my closet waiting to be used and it's just as good as actually it's better than this because I find that regular coconut oil works better on my teeth I don't know why and it does work by the way it does work because I from the last um the last cleaning I did from at the dentist I started the pulling oil or the oil pulling and then my next appointment that I had in June to check my teeth 
they said that my teeth had improved, but they didn't know why they had improved. I didn't tell them what I was doing. A lot of dentists don't like the idea of oil pulling. So I never bothered to tell them what I was doing differently. I just said, oh, I don't know. I've been doing everything the same. Um, Hello Fresh or Hello Friendly Natural Mint with Aloe Vera and Coconut Oil. I love these. They're expensive. They're less they're less in the bottle than what you get with Listerine and whatnot, but I don't know. I just like the, the natural version better of a mouthwash. I'm starting to like the natural version of a mouthwash better. Um, I can get those at the dollar store. So if I find them at the dollar store again, I'm going to pick them up. Uh, it's because they're a better price. Biosance Squalene Elderberry Jelly Cleanser. This was fantastic. Loved this. I kept it in the shower, used it in the shower. It was emollient. You can use it as a double cleanse to take off your makeup and then do a, a second cleanse. Um, would I get it again? I might. It's plant-based. Oh no, plant-derived. And I think it's cruelty-free. Um, maybe not. But anyways... Nonetheless, it was great. If it was on sale again, I would get it or I'd get it at the 20% off sale from Sephora. Um, this is the acne patches with salicylic acid and tea tree oil. 80% faster acne healing. This, fantastic. These are fantastic. I need to find, I need to find these again. I found them on Amazon like a couple of years ago and you, you get 132 patches. I still have one more sheet left that I took out of the box and I'm, I'm getting rid of the box um but because it's a mix of acne salicylic acid and tea tree oil I like the combination of the two and I like that I can put it on the next morning gone or it's a definitely significantly less than what it was so um so far my skin in the last two week or week or so has not been too bad um I'm, and then I find that when I eat more garbage, my skin will tell me that I'm eating garbage. Um, so I try to keep a cleaner eating habits. But nonetheless, when I need these in a pinch, for whatever reason, they are fantastic. Amazon. Um, Kylie Skin. This is the Vanilla Milk Toner. So glad I finished this. Um, I bought a set of her full-size products. The whole set. It came with, um, a face cream. It came with a face cream. The toner. The exfoliator. The eye cream. And something else. I can't remember. The serum. And, um, I pretty much finished everything now, but the eye cream, the eye cream, I'm still go running through, but honestly, Kylie Jenner, you're just paying for, you're just paying for the name. That's all this is. You're paying for the name. I don't care what anyone says. The product itself is not like over the top out of this world. I feel like young girls in there between like 15 to 25 can pull this line off because it's made for younger skin. As you're getting older, um, especially because I'm 35, this stuff is not enough to help me. I need anti-aging. I need acids. I need ex like proper chemical exfoliants. I need SPF. Um, I don't know if she has an SPF. I think she does. I didn't get a chance to try it. And honestly, I'm not interested in trying it because I am very particular with my SPF. Has to be oil free because I tend to break out with SPF if it's not oil free. Um, so yeah, I'm glad this is done. I won't get it again. Um, the Briogeo Farewell Frizz Rosarco Milk Leave-In Conditioning Spray. This was good. Um, it was a travel size. I tried to get tried to get some more out but there's like a little bit left I wonder if I can um I might pour this out when I wash my hair there's some I can pour out so I'm gonna try and do that Amika perk up dry shampoo um loved this I want to buy one full size I'm waiting for the next VIB sale and I'm gonna get one of those. I have so many dry shampoos right now, I just don't need any more. So I have that on my wish list, but I'm not there yet. Um, Endless Summer Spray. This is by Playa. This was good. Um, it's gone. 
I wouldn't get it again though. I have other, I have other summer sprays like sea salt sprays. Uh, Kat Von D, this is Lolita in the travel size. I'm, it's gone bad and I've used it quite a bit of time. So I'm parting ways with that. Um, I finished my Young Living Thieves essential oil. So um, I love Young Living, especially when it comes to the essential oil quality. This is an essential oil that my massage therapist uses on me every time I go. And she recommends if I do need to use it internally, I can use this brand to drop in tea or whatnot. Um, you, uh, you have to be careful with essential oils, so do your research. Um, but I am a big essential oils person. I cannot live without them. I use them a lot to heal. Um, I've been actually turning more towards them to heal opposed to over-the-counter drugs like Advil or Aleve. And, like, I'll only use Advil and Aleve now if I absolutely need to. Um, but for the most part, like, I'll stick to, I'll stick to essential oils if I can handle, um, the temporary suffering. But that's, they're expensive. They're really expensive. Like this retail, this bottle alone is like 70 to $80. I can get it at wholesale um, for a bit cheaper, but they're expensive, but they work. That's all I'm gonna say. Um, so I also finished the Glow Recipe Guava Vitamin C Dark Spot Serum. This one was really good, I liked it. It really helped even out my skin tone. It kept my texture down a little bit. I have to start including vitamin C in my skincare routine. I haven't really been, the last five days I haven't been doing that, but I have to get back into the routine of it. Um, would I buy it again? I would, I really would, but I have to get through some other serums first. Um, you guys, I'm, I'm, I'm letting go of my ColourPop Super Shock Cheek Pearlized highlighter in wisp i've had this since probably 2016 like i've hit some major pan but it's time to go i can't use this anymore i i have other stuff that i can use and i i can't have to let it go it's it's too old now um so we are parting ways with this but i'm okay i have tons of highlighters so i'm not worried um would i buy it again probably not Okay, so I have this uh, body salt scrub by Cosette. It's gray sea salt and bamboo charcoal. It's packed with mineral rich and premium ingredients. Um, I the only thing the only problem I had with this, I liked it, but the the opening, like the opening is too small. So the big granules, it gets clogged and it can't come out. Um, that's the only thing I had an issue with it. Otherwise, it's a nice one. I would get it. I would like to get it in a full size if I had the chance, if it was on sale, but the, the packaging turned me off. I'll be honest. Uh, last but not least, I finished the Peter Thomas Roth Water Drench Hyaluronic Glow Serum. This claims 120 hours of enhanced hydration. I don't know if it's really 120 hours. I have two of these on backup. Oh, damn, I did finish everything. Um, I have two of these on backup. That's how much I like this stuff. It is, let me see if I can get any little bit out. We'll try. I don't know. I really did finish up quite a bit of it. Yeah, it's pretty much gone. Um, love this. Love it more so in the winter because that's when I need my hydration the most. I have two of these on backup and I will use them, but I wanna try some other stuff before I go back to it because that is a tried and true. I know that I, my skin loves it. Um, and uh, yeah, so, okay guys, that was it. Those are my June MDs. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know down below if you have any questions about the products. Um, we'll see what July brings us. And uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.